This week on Wallbot Wednesday, we track down more of our developers to ask them your questions. Can Wallbot help you in a fight? Do it yourself projects, and what do you get when you buy Wallabot? Turn a member of the dev teams in the conference room. Let's ask him a question. Shahar! Shahar! Yeah! It's Wallabot Wednesday. We need questions answered. Now. We heard from Muay Thai champion Sol Renato. He asked the following Can Wallabot measure the number of punches and kicks I do along with their speed? Uh, yeah, sure. Wallabot can do that. Uh... The, when you punch, the velocity of your punch can be detected using Doppler effect, and uh, Wallbot can measure that. So uh, it can also measure the velocity, and it can also measure the number of punches per second. Like this punch? Yeah, exactly. Ofer. Yes. Michael McGarren's got a question. Okay. His roof has got a layer of tiles. Underneath that is plywood, and at the bottom are structural beams. Okay. He wants to know what can Wallbot see through. Okay, so actually Wallabot can see through all of these different layers. So it can see through the tiles, then through the plywood and the structural beams. And um, even if they're kind of sandwiched together, it will be able to differentiate between the different layers. Got one final question from David. He asks the following. I'm not a maker, but will I still be able to use Wallabot? And what do I actually get when Wallabot arrives at my door? So David, two questions, but we'll let it slide. So, Wallabot plays nice with makers and non-makers alike. When you get it, basically we'll have our Wallabot board, along with a USB cord that will plug it into a cell phone or a PC. From there, you download different applications, and you'll be up and running and using it right away. If you're a do-it-yourself guy and you want to use it for home construction to look at your walls, right away it'll be active and ready to use. If you're a maker and want to go deeper, you can use our API to create different custom applications based on whatever you want to make. Um, so that concludes our series on questions, and we want to say thank you guys for submitting them. So we've got t-shirts we're hooking you up with as a little way to show our appreciation. Happy Wall Ball Wednesday.